And, you know, I, I thought, okay, God, I believe you love me, but I don't see it. So I went back to what I knew. I went back to this Bible, and I read through it, and I go, well, let's figure out what you say is true, and I'll go with it. And I'll remember that Romans 8.28 is the first verse that I went to, um, and it says it here, if you want to look up. And we know that in all things, God works for the good of those who love him according, that have been called according to his purpose. So this is essentially telling me that God is working something good out in everything I'm doing. I'm sitting there praying in the morning with teary eyes from sleep crying, going, God, what is good? You said you're working something good out. What is good? Tell me, please, because right now, all I can see is the pain that I am in, and I don't see any good. So don't tell me that this is true. And he didn't have to tell me it because he already told me I had to believe it was true. I had to choose the same way I had to choose whether Jesus is real or not. I had to choose this was real. I didn't see it, so I put it on the back burner. I said, God, I believe you love me, and I will believe this is true, but I don't see it right now. And so I went further, and I went to Romans. And I'm sorry, I went to Matthew. Matthew 5. It was the next verse that really helped me out. Blessed are those who mourn, for they will be comforted. That was Jesus' words. I know that because it was in red. 